Hey guys, and welcome back to another ranked video. Today I was invited by Com from V1 to join him and his friend in some 3v3 games. His friend, who goes by Rusty, usually sits around 1600 to 1700 range in Rocket League, which makes him, I believe, around GC1 or GC2. So let's see how we can do as a team against a full squad of SSL players. I ended up going really in-depth in this video, so I hope you guys get something out of it for your own gameplay. So let's see if we can catch some wins together. Let's get right into it. <laughs> We're at Gimmick, Epic Johnny, and Geo. Uh, Geo's solo queue here, but I've uh, I've played against uh, Epic Johnny and uh, Gimmick quite a bit, so pretty familiar. I've also seen uh, Geo quite a bit in, in threes, not in twos. Oh, I like this. This is interesting. 50-50. It's a good beat. Tom should have this for free across. Good play from Rusty. So this is um this is Com's friend. I don't really um oh it's fine. I don't really I don't really know how he plays. So I'm gonna try try and get a read on this. We oh, missed. We Com's play here. It's fine. It's gonna be beat here. So Rusty made a touch out there like that. Um, it's not really gonna be possible to really follow it up. So I just need to wait for it. It's gonna be a uh, gimmick's touch here, and uh, Com should have it. I know his name is Gore Snap, but. I'm not really sure what that's about. It's about underneath. Oh. Nice. Just one. Cross. Bump him a little bit. Tom should have it. Go back right. Nice pop. It's around the one. Epic Johnny's probably going to have this in the corner. I'm just going to wait in mid. Mick will have that. So Rusty's up, but he's probably going to miss this. So I know that I'm going to try and challenge early. It's so over the one. Geo went forward. Good save. Got told boost. Try to put that down to calm. I got bumped, so I had to like kind of follow it up a little bit with a side flip. Can't really follow this properly. I don't want to make a touch that's going to be worse than the situation. When those balls bounce off the, off the backboard, it's actually sometimes better just to leave them. I should be one of them to turn here. Oh, close. Get behind uh, Com here so we can have a free touch. Take this boost as well. It's open. Ooh! Oh, <laughs> uh, never mind. It's not open. I'm going to go here. Over the one. I can't follow this because uh, Geo's going to beat me, so I'm just going to stop wasting boost. Tom should have that on the, on the backboard, no problem. Take his boost if I can. Good 50 50. Hopefully, pass across. Good boom. We two of them. Jill will probably have this again, too, so there's no point in me uh, over overextending. Good play there. Really good cutoff from uh, um, from Com in the corner. Try and bump him if I can. So here I'm going to loop wide. I was going to watch for mid passes just in case he was going for it. I could tell that he wasn't going to get it. So I just ended up going for back corner boost. Get a nice little block. Maybe a pass mid from Com. Maybe a heavy touch off the backboard. So hopefully Rusty can get there. Not going to be a follow up because uh, Com died. But I can turn on this. Get a pretty free shot. Make it pretty awkward. I hope I w I hope that Rusty stayed there in the corner. It would have been a lot better for us. And this touch is going to be awkward here unless he can follow it up. But he does follow it up pretty nicely. And Com has a free ball now. Off the double off the backboard. Pop this up high off the backboard. Rusty tries to go. Might have bumped Calm out of position here. Nice. Calm's free ball now. Once again, I was hoping that Rusty would be in the mid there. I'm finding that we're having those like awkward um, mix-ups there where there's like positions that he could be filling. But that's okay because we're, we're doing all right. Um, like holding the defense. Definitely have a... I think we have most of the pressure. Um, yeah, you can see we actually have pretty even shots. I think we have six. They have four. So pretty even. Tom's doing a lot of the defensive work here. So it's going to need to follow up that position in mid and try to catch that, that uh, early dribble catch from them. Nice 50-50. Rusty should be over there. Nice. Can we touch from gimmick? A boom over Epic Johnny. I like this follow-up from Rusty. There's there's a good position off the, uh, off the position uh, across mid there to cut that. It's really good to uh, make sure you cover as many options as possible. I'm going to go here. Try to pop this around. Take the boost. Get the 50-50. One thing I'm just playing. 
a nuisance roll. Good positioning from uh, Rusty once again. It's a lot better just to hold those positions. Even if it's not the greatest touch, you are there. And if I don't go, then nice catch. Um, on the one. This could be a free touch for Epic Johnny, though. Rusty. Oh. Yeah, so I don't know what happened there. Because I think Rusty was maybe way on the back corner boost. Oh, he did a double take. So right there, he should have just went back to defense if there's no uh, boost. Get a few pads. There's like 48, uh, 48 boost worth of pads. Um... You know, on their way to net. Oh, sorry. Should be Rusty's ball now. Nice. Once again, pick up, pick up some pads. Hoping Calm could follow that after he jumped. I'm not sure though. We'll go across. There's no boost. Good pass and play opportunity. Nice clear. And we got the bottom left slot. Let's go. I I didn't actually know what was gonna happen there. It was a little dangerous for me to go because uh. Calm was forward, and uh, the other guy jumped, and I was a little bit worried about getting in, uh, getting in the way of uh, of Calm there, but it ended up working. It's hard to know sometimes when you're airling that without Calms to know who is uh, is actually the one jumping for the ball, like whether it's the uh, the opponent or not. I'm gonna get 50-50 here. Still up, unfortunately. Oh. <laughs> Tried for the pre-jump, so did uh, I think it was calm as well, but pretty good first game. Um, once again, like I, I'm, I'm very much a person to have to get a read on a player um, to understand how to rotate around them. And, and honestly, Rusty's pretty solid for um, what I think calm said he was like 1600, 1700. So um, pretty easy to play around. Just a few positions you can tell that are a little bit of a gap, but I, uh, I expect that those will improve. Well, this is a pretty stacked lobby here, so this is where, <laughs> this is gonna be uh, where it tests uh, if we can hold our own here as a team. Because we got a big upgrade on, on the other team. It's off the wall, try to follow it here. Hopefully I bump gimmick enough that Calm can get a free shot. He does. Nice 50-50. Off the wall. Hopefully Calm can stay with it. I'll let him take the double here. Let's start trying to stay close. Oh, this is bad. Oh, well, I can't tell what's happening. <laughs> I'll take this back corner wait for uh, the next play. Nice. Good 50-50. Can't quite go for this. A little awkward touch from Rusty, but... To the thing we can't handle. Nice touch with the corner. Good fake. Calm likes to do those. I have noticed in pro play he does that a lot. Um, and it is really smart because it, it gives the uh, gives you a lot of space. Gimmick, get off me. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna wait for the touch here from Epic Johnny. It's across. So Rusty's pushing it. Calm probably sees that, so he's backing off. I'm gonna watch out for demos. His third man here too. Rusty has some space. Get the mid boost. To be Collins ball for free. Nice shot. Gimmicks last. I was waiting for maybe Colin to pass that. It's a good shot. There we go. Nice. Good play from uh, from me and Colin there. Um, I sorry, I lost my train of thought because there's just so many players coming at me <laughs> that I had to really think about that. I went for a delayed uh, block on the clear because if he goes around the corner, then someone can catch it. So I'm watching for the outwards clear, which is why I watch it that way. Too pretty dangerous unless I don't go early here. Nice. Nice flick over two, over three. Tight angle shot. Can I make it? Oh, I, I got the angle, but um, not the height that I needed. Oh, my bad. Oh! <laughs> what? What is that? <laughs> um, what is that? I need to have some sort of connection with someone like that in this game, man. I'm gonna invite my friends to play the game. That's fine. It's actually better that Rusty misses that, funny enough. That's just Rocket League. Oh, it's not good. Although, if I had more boost, I could have followed that up, even though I made a weird touch. That's crazy. They're feeling it. 
Oh, I really thought he was going to uh, hit that uh, outwards. That clear is going to go to nobody, so we get some boost pads. Nice clear. Oh, she should be next. Could probably be a pass back from Gimmick or something. Popped up nice and high. Maybe Rusty can pass this down. Oh, close. He, was, he wasn't able to get uh, far enough on the wall there to uh, pass it back. I'm going to move behind. Good aggression from Rusty there. Oh, and the shot. Oh, my God. <laughs> what is happening? We're doing better now. Then we were against the other team, which is kind of wild. We'll go back, uh, back right here. Nice. I'll stay with this if I can. Oh, uh, I didn't hit the ceiling until way late. If that came down faster, I could have followed it up. It's always really, really tough when that like skims the roof like that. All right. Somehow I didn't demo him. I was trying to get a double demo, but yeah, that's unfortunate. I, I, it probably would have still been a goal to be fair. Cause I was, in, I was last man there. I thought that uh, Calm had control, but then Gimmick went for the demo as well, so a bit tough there. I'm not, I'm not sure I didn't demo. I did turn at the last second to try and bump him off or something. Good play. I like that positioning. Should be Calm here. Once again, just picking up some pads. He's got a full reset. And Alpha does the same thing again. Yeah. I mean, I, that's very common uh, for Alpha Cap. He, when he's uh, when he's down goals, I find that he does that a lot more because he just tends to try and um, change his play style, which is smart. I actually think that's like a really good idea. Is that she's gonna be okay that it goes across like that. Nice block as well, Rusty. Should have that for free. Gimmick doesn't have that. It's a little too far. Pop it forward. Hopefully, Calm can follow it. Rusty's gonna have a better um, approach, but. Um, I think Calm could have kept more control there since he's not moving as fast with the touches here. Should be Rusty's ball. Nice clear. He's going to turn on this immediately and boom it. Which I already know. This could be tough. Nice read. I'm going to have to be third man here because both my teammates jump for that. I got bumped off that ball. I'm stuck on Calm. <laughs> Alright. A little dangerous. Good patience. Hopefully to Rusty. Close. Can't quite follow this, so I'm just gonna get behind. Try to turn for this boost. Good play. Oh my. Too bad. Good luck. Yep. <laughs> I really thought that was my ball, and then once I saw Calm go up for it, like he was off the side, I kind of panicked a little bit and got off the ball. But I think I could have, uh, with my header boost there, I could have went for a bigger clear, for sure. It should be comms for you clear. All right, this is fine. He's probably going to touch this again. That should be down. Nice. All right, so good second game. Uh, we were we were up on 3-0, and then they ended up almost coming back, which is pretty dangerous. But I, I hate this menu, man. I Rocket League. It's been, I think, a year and a half of this. Please stop doing this. I will leave the lobby when I want to. Thank you. Or at least have the option to turn it off. Cause I just, I just, it's so annoying. Like I want to talk after a game happens and I'm not the party leader. So then it just ends up, you know, with that big menu that just shows up on my screen every time that I'm talking. If I'm not the party leader, it's kind of annoying. Oh, right, we got uh, Aquario, AJ16 and Docs. I, I always get, I always get confused about Docs cause I thought like I've seen him play before. I'm never sure it's, if it's, um, cool. It's, it's my bad. See, I never really usually go on those. And I'm like, oh, maybe I should. But then I realized, no, that's probably why I don't go for those. Because that happens. Because I know that my teammates are still coming back. Uh, but as I was saying, Docs, I always think is like Daunt for some reason. But um, I don't think it's the same person at all. Nice. Good play. Oh. Should be Rusty's ball. I think Rusty's staying with it, though. Close. Get the boost. Give me a block here or a cut. Oh. I'm going to fake him here because there's two of them going. Good boom. To be rusty forward. Nice little block. To come mid for uh, one of them. Tom will probably cut this off before anyone can get to it. I got bumped off, unfortunately, but this actually could work for us. The bad touch can be a little bit heavy. 
Nice clear. Go for the mid boost here. Around the one. Nice little block. Oh, Rusty went for that, unfortunately. All right, so not on the same page right now, but that's okay. We'll figure it out. Nice clear around the one. Nice block around for the, around the second one as well. It's two of them. Great placement. Nice one. So I, 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 I recognize that there was probably not a chance or probably a small chance that after AJ16 went out of the way there that um, the other guy would challenge since he's last. So it actually put them in a lot of pressure when they didn't need to be in, under pressure since they could have had someone challenging that. All right, this is a little bit awkward. That's okay though. So I use that to my advantage. I'm probably gonna beat here if I if I go. So I'm just gonna try and block uh, at least some of the angles. Good block from Rusty. I'm gonna go here for the pass. So the uh, the angles were definitely cut off for net. I think the the open pass opportunity there was definitely available. Oh, that was awkward. Should be okay though. Tom should have this. Nice little block. Tom's gonna wait on the side. Good try, good bump. Oh, I like that. Rusty coming for the free shot. Oh, so close. Block over the backboard. That's totally fine because two of them are overcommitted. I think Rusty would have had a better touch there, but it ended up working because Calm just left it um, off that small touch. Nice touch. Just gonna make sure I get a beat there, just keeping it in. Take the boost as well. Good try on the catch. I'm gonna stay with this. try on the one get demo from calm as well rusty should get in here at least for something which he does oh nice double there we go got off the ceiling challenge good that rusty went up not the best of touches but it does keep the pressure a little bit calm's probably gonna make a challenge here Two of them. Rusty failed a turn. Maybe pass it. Oh, this is dangerous. We clear this corner. Watch out for the demo. Try to pinch it. Pretty close. I probably could have shot that. If I shot it, it would have been a lot better. I should also just beat that guy. I was too focused on the shot. Good save. Oh, good try. I'll leave that for calm now. Pop it over. Let's keep the pressure once again. Touch off the corner. Nice block as well. Rusty should have this for free. He's in clear. Both of them are going to go for this. He might have a double here. Make it awkward clear for them. It kind of worked. Let Rusty get in here. I'm going to go all the way back for back corner because they're probably going to get a clear of some sort here. So Calm will have that. Off the back back wall. Like that. Just keeping them on their toes. We don't need to do anything too crazy. Keeping it in again. Just keep booming it. Oh, so close. We got a nice reset. Or not a reset, but just a nice flip. Ooh, got bumped. We get a nice clear. Should lead us probably to overtime unless we can make something happen here. I almost got demo to get her off the spawn. Is that in? That was in. <laughs> Woo! That would have been a nice finish. All right, so Calm should have this off the pinch. Now Rusty for free. It's a good shot. I'm going to keep pushing up on this just to cause pressure. There's no reason for me to go all the way back with zero boost and not, you know, do something and be relevant. Get that too heavy. i him off the boost if I could. Get behind and go for the back corner. Should be Rusty's turn. A double this to myself off the wall.
Oh, I did not make that shot heavy enough. I could have boomed that most likely. Oh, double from Rusty? Oh, that works. Nice pinch. Like that fake. Oh, shoot. Did not think Rusty would go for that. He has to go right away. Oh, man, that sucks. Yeah, Rusty cut me off when I was driving forward, and then I turned away. Um, I probably could have just went, but I definitely think that he should have just let me go for that play while I was already recovering. Um, but he pushed up in front of me, and then we both got caught up. So a little bit of an awkward play, but we'll move on to the next game. We'll do uh, we'll do one more. All right, we got uh, the last game was VK Salen with uh, Epic Johnny and Gimmick now. Oh, boy. Here we go. They're really, really trying to put, put it to the test. Go for the back corner. Good challenge. I got bumped off the play here, but I can probably stay with this. Good try. Get the touch here. At least go back. Oh. A little dangerous. Heavy touch, though, from Gimmick. Got it? Yeah. Okay, nice. I had to watch that mid mid play there just in case. So over the one, Epic Johnny's a little bit awkward. Make sure VK has to clear it. Rusty should try to go for this. Nice. Good 50 50. I'm just going to leave it and I'll bump him. All right, I'll stay with this. I'm going to let him touch it first. I have no boost, so I'm just going to try and go back here. Nice clear to the side. I didn't mean to take that boost, but it's unfortunate. Uh, the way this is going to play out, yeah. I'd, I knew it was going to happen when Rusty had no boost, and I was trying to go for the clear in the corner. I think uh, Rusty could have stayed in net, though, after the, the touch of the corner. He got, he got a little bit caught up trying to get the, some boost pads. Nice clear. Gonna be their ball though. Ah, that's my bad. It's gonna be tough for me. You missed. Give this boost, please. Thank you. Oh, we're just getting caught at, caught in really weird positions. I think uh, Calm has that. Oh boy. No, that's a throwaway. <laughs> Both me and Calm realized the second that Rusty made that touch. We're getting we're getting really, really outclassed here because we're just not holding on to the ball when we need to in these like very important clear moments. So we're getting stuck on our own end. But oh boy. Nice clear. It's fine. Nice clear. Oh boy. Okay, I'm gonna move. I'm gonna move behind. All right, we're losing. We're losing our touch here. Over gimmick. Oh no, Rusty! We gotta stop throwing the ball away, man. We're gonna. We're not gonna get any. Uh, any offense if we can't. Um, you know, get the ball on their end. Uh, if we make these little touches, they're just gonna wait for us to make these clears, and uh, they're gonna keep beating us in situations that are really, really important for us to lose the pressure on our end. Nice. Close. Off the corner. Rusty should be able to shoot this. My bad. Not the greatest shot. No way. Yeah, they're really awkward. Hopefully Rusty can get in there. He needs to try to go. Bump him if I can. Rusty's ball. Two of them. Good try. Pass back to me. What the heck? Oh my god, he missed. Maybe that's to Rusty. Pass across. No. Close. I'm trying to bump VK off of the ball here. That's in our in their net. <laughs> in our net, I mean. <laughs> oh boy. 
All right, awkward game, awkward game. Definitely, uh, definitely outclassed here. Just can't get any pressure because we've thrown the ball away just too many times. Oh my! And I'm dead. Open passes to the wall to Rusty. He went for the back corner boost. Uh, it's probably gonna be a goal too. So need to work with each other a little more off the the clears and the positions. Oh my, this is a messy game. I really don't feel like I can... I'm very comfortable in anything that's happening here. <laughs> I'm going to be honest with you. He's going to beat here. We're just playing for like too many uh, awkward quick passing plays. It's not really going to result in anything because someone's going to be ready for it faster than we are. gonna fake that and try to go for the boost i missed the boost that's unfortunate i mean there's only 10 seconds left anyway so you know we'll do one more because we can't we can't go uh even in the in the games here off the backboard they're both not ready for it close i mean with the time left i probably could have just went for a shot on target but that was a really awkward game that's probably the worst game we've had so far which makes sense because it's vk sailing on the other team but i really feel like we should have had more pressure just because we kept losing it off of the one panic touch and it's that that's the big difference too between like a, a 600 player and um, someone who's more familiar with the pressure that teams are going to create at this level, at really high level SSL, is the fact that there are situations where the defense hitting the ball away is actually the best thing that could happen for your offense. So putting putting the uh, the opponents in a position where they feel like they have to make one last touch to get out of defense is the exact thing that's going to keep them in defense. So sometimes like using the space and just like letting the ball bounce in front of you is super super important. And uh, we just weren't doing that enough uh, as a team in that game, for sure. And I think that like these losses are actually like, really, really good to show just how pressure can get to people um, in the game. And how it's really, really important to learn how to utilize the space. When you, I, I, It's like card counting in poker or like in, in, uh, in a casino. You have to count the players and the boost they've been using. It's a very, very, uh, very, very, very important skill and something that not a lot of people I think work on when they when they should work on it more is to just make sure you realize okay player player a just went for the ball and used probably 40 boosts to go for that ball and pass it off the backboard player B just boomed it off the side corner to pass it to player C so they probably used 20 to 30 to 40 boosts and then player C came into the rotation so the player a is now trying to get for those uh, run for those boosts if both of your corners and your on your on your team are taken then that means player a needs needs to find a different avenue to get 100 boost back so their rotation will be slower. So protecting your back corner boost, for example, will will slow down the rotation of the opponents, not just improve you, the rotation of yours. So there's there's plenty of things to think about, um, but pro players just constantly analyze those things in their head constantly. So they know they know when a play is going to fizzle out before a viewer will. Anyway, we'll move on to the next game, the final game, and see how it goes. All right, the final game, we got Geo again at the end. We did win that game against them, so hopefully we can win again and get the 3-2 record for today. Um, let's see if we can pass this back corner. Nice clear. Up to the back right. Oh, I just missed the mark. Yeah, this this low camera uh, stiffness is definitely interesting. Oh my. Um, I find it very hard to accurately get a challenge in or like figure out my spacing. It's unfortunate though, that 50-50. Stay with this if I can with full boost. To be Rusty's ball for free. Oh, big fakes. Oh. Nice 50 50. Give me some of a clear to the side. Just trying the bump. Should be good. Calm with the pass across. Nice cut off. I like that. Should be comms touch here, maybe. Round two. Pass across. Maybe Rusty finish. Nice. So I actually probably could have shot that. I was a little bit worried about um, trying to direct the the shot on target because it looked like Geo's gonna make it clear right here. So I tried to go around him, and it actually worked out really well to pass it over to Rusty. I think if I went on the direct shot on target. Once again, people are watching for that. Um, 
Um, oh, that's fine. Um, they'll they'll more more than li more than likely uh, watch the, the passes instead of or are the uh, shot on target rather than the pass. The situation is last man. That's fine. Bad flick from uh, gimmick. Around him. Be Rusty's ball here. Nice, good shot. Watch out for the demos behind here. Over, but Rusty should have this. Oh my. That's their last. Round two. Epic Dino will probably catch this on the wall. Good catch from Calm to cut him off early. That boost did spawn, unfortunately. I thought it wasn't there. I, I looked away. Backboards, two of them. Missed. Not the strongest of shots. Trying to stay in front here. Nice shot. The bad clear. Rusty's too far, though. And him trying afterwards is going to be really bad for us. That doubles actually going to be better for us because we can get around on the ball. Nice save. It's two of them. I like this play from Rusty because their last man's going to be under pressure. Good shot as well. Uh oh. Nice. Hopefully he leaves that boost. He does. Two of them. Hopefully we can bump this guy. Uh oh. It's two of them. That's uh, a little dangerous. I can't quite follow this. I think we could have left that bounce for me to follow it, but it works out. Oh, this is going to be good. Oh my. Round two. Happy Johnny has it clear. I get this mid boost if I can. Nice. He's gonna double this probably. Should be back for calm and a nice shot. Epic Johnny can't get to it, and there we go. Nice. That was a bit quiet there, but I was just trying to make sure I uh, was playing that properly. That was really good of me to get the bump. I actually passed back to uh, calm as well in that in that same play, which is just a little bit lucky. I'm not gonna uh, lie about that. That was a very lucky bounce. Shout out lucky bounce, old team. Nice pass, middle. I'm gonna get a clear over. Geo will probably pass this to the side. It's getting in the way. I'm gonna try and grab a few boost pads while I can as well. All right, not the best play, but we do keep it uh, at least close. Get a clear forward. Really good positioning from Rusty there on the side. Although he didn't quite get the touch I thought he was going to. He could have probably popped that around. Uh, one there. Maybe pretty low boost. That's around me. I can't follow it, unfortunately. Really good. Uh, once again, really good positioning from Rusty, though, to follow that early. Big misses. Hopefully he can get in the way. Uh oh. Okay, I'm panicking because we uh, we're making cuts on the ball when I'm not expecting it, so I kind of played that pretty wrong. But oh, big misses! I'm just gonna wait. And there we go. All right, so GGS is pretty good. Uh, pretty good. Set oh, once again, uh, there's the there's the menu popping up again. I hate that. I really wish you could disable it at least. Uh, GG's, that was a really good set of games. Hope you guys learned something. Uh, I definitely think that was a, a really, really good set of games uh, to learn about, like, the difference between high-level play and maybe, like, GC3, GC2. But it was a lot of fun to play those games with uh, Calm and his friend. Um, Rusty played pretty well. He actually, like, held his own in a lot of those lobbies, obviously with a full pro lobby. Well, Epic Johnny's not necessarily a pro, but he's a really, really good player. Um, he uh, definitely held his own, and I think that even in the game that we the games we lost, there was a lot, a lot to learn, so... Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Definitely uh, looking to do more face cam in the future. I have not really done it too late, uh, too much lately, just because I don't know, just don't like to do it really. <laughs> I feel like there's this whole thing where I had to like 
I make a lot of faces during Rocket League, so I just like don't like to use a face cam too often. But if you guys like it, let me know. I'll try to use it more often. But until next time, have a great day, guys. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Hmm, darn. Oh. He didn't see me. Here Wait, do you see my spot? Hi, children. <laughs> I don't. I feel like the chill doesn't do anything. Do you Wait, see where I like, am? Uh, you're, I see you uh, overlapping with the you generator. The generator? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> That's so <Hi>. smart. <laughs> Is there anyone That's else alive? Cool. No, it's just you. Yeah. Five seconds. Don't die. Oh, they're so, they're so mad. <laughs> they're so mad. They're about to be so dead.